The Crying Woman, Part 2, Listen and Practice She had decided something. She could not live like this anymore. Guillermo stopped loving her when they had children. So if they didn't have children, maybe he would love her again, they went to the river. Go into the water, my children, she said, but, mum, they said. We can't swim, that is fine, she said. Your mother will help you, they went into the water, where it was deep. Immaculata said, goodbye, my children, then she pushed her children under the water. They shouted, and she cried, but she did not stop. The children drowned, and died, Immaculata stood in the river. It was done. She had drowned her children. Would Guillermo love her now? But when she saw their bodies, she understood what she had done. I am a monster, she cried. I cannot live like this. Immaculata wanted to drown with her children, but she was afraid. So she took a knife and cut herself. Her blood went into the river. It ran over her body, and it ran over the bodies of her children. That night, Guillermo came home, but Immaculata wasn't there. His children weren't there, how strange, he said. But really, he was happy. He didn't love Immaculata anymore. Did that make him a monster? The next day, he took Blanca to the river. Blanca was the Spanish girl he was in love with. She was more beautiful than Immaculata, and he could tell everyone that he loved her. Guillermo, she said, I am afraid. I cannot swim, Guillermo laughed. Then be careful. I am going to get a bottle of wine. Take off your shoes and put your feet in the water. It feels good, so Blanca took off her shoes and put her feet in the water. It did feel good. But then she heard a strange sound. Someone was crying. She looked around, but she saw nobody. Then she looked in the water, in the bottom of the river, there was a woman in a white dress. She was looking for something. Oh, my children, where are you? She cried. Who is that woman at the bottom of the river? Said Blanca. She looked closer, and then she fell in the water. The river was fast, and the water was deep. Help, help, she cried. Guillermo. But Guillermo did not come to help her. She felt a cold, wet hand on her foot. The hand pulled her down. When Guillermo came back, Blanca had drowned. Oh my God, he said. She is dead. He looked in the river, but he did not touch the body. He thought he saw something white like a white dress. But when he looked again, there was nothing there, I must return to Spain, he said. Nothing good comes from this place, so Guillermo left. He went back to Spain, and Immaculata stayed in the river. The people in the village called her the crying woman, La Llorona, and from that day, People were always careful when they went near the river. The End